We want to talk about the new earth, the shift in dimension, and you might have heard many people speak about this shift in dimensions that's happening, that the earth is splitting. Some people will be in the new earth and others not. Um, or you might have heard of heaven coming to earth. And people that are speaking about this shift, this heaven, this new earth, are on the internet you'll see um, there's Eckhart Tolle, there's the late Dolores Cannon, there's Bashar being channeled, and then in the past Jesus was speaking about it, the Buddha was speaking about it. These are people that meditated so deep into themselves that they realized the, the new earth through themselves and they were trying to, well, they were communicating this to us and that there is a new earth, a heaven, coming down to earth, like descending onto this earth. And the way that it is happening is that it is happening through our bodies. The Buddha also spoke about meditating into, 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 into the body, and then the nirvana state is, is understood. I don't want to say achieved. It's, it's actually sort of remembered. Now, I'm going to show you how to do it. Um, it's something that I have been doing by accident. <laughs> I started doing it by accident in 2018, and then I've been practicing to do it more and more and more. Um, and sometimes the more I meditate, the more it's happening. It takes a tremendous amount, amount of surrender. And that surrender is into the body. Now, the way that we bring the new earth, the way that we manifest heaven on earth, is through our bodies. We don't shift into another place. <laughs> it's right here. It is right here. But it is a shift in our perception that happens. It's really like standing on the one foot, and you're in the one reality and then just standing on the other foot and your perception has changed and you're in a completely different reality. I have, um, in the past, I've felt myself being in, in a room with, this, with people and then through like a very small little meditation, open my eyes and my, my, my entire reality has shifted. I can see I'm in exactly the same space as what I was before and, and everyone else is, but everything is perfect in absolute harmony and incredibly, incredibly glorious and beautiful. Um, I've also driven in a car where people are talking and I can feel how what they are talking about, the consciousness, the problems, how it that consciousness like entangles itself around itself and how being in exactly the same space, in exactly the same car, I am able to, through tuning into a vibration in my body, completely be in a different movie, like my movie is completely different. Like there's only glory around me, only heaven, 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 heaven. So I want to give you some tips on how to do it. I believe everyone can do it. You don't have to wait until you're perfect. Your life is important. This new earth the heaven on earth happens through us like we are all incarnated with the capacity to have this realization through ourselves like a res resolution and like resolve our condition <laughs> and realize that we are one with the divine and with the divine perf perfection but you know we 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 still in a space of that good and evil, good and evil, good and evil, that attachment, that attachment. And when we shift into the new earth, there's only the whoosh, glory, only the glory. It's a bit of a freak out because suddenly that whoosh, contraction of the trauma ceases to exist and it's, it's hectic for the consciousness. It's like whoosh, suddenly seeing God in like whoosh, so much. And... I believe it's a good idea to, well, for me anyway, 
to dip my toes in and to slowly get myself my consciousness accustomed to that level of glory every time i go in it's like oh, oh like totally fantastic but almost too difficult to to hold and then to start practicing to hold that level of expansion and glory now the way that we dip our toes in <laughs> to heaven to the sensation of heaven the way that we 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 almost we we bringing heaven into earth like in flashes in flashes through us so enlightenment can happen in one like whoop, the curtain just opens or it can happen in little like peekaboo 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 ah ah until until we can handle so much more so even if we just do those little peekaboos through the veil <laughs> through this 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 veil of contraction into this heavenly state um we get accustomed it accustomed to it and we are through our bodies we are bringing we are bringing the new state into this earth and we don't have to do it if we don't do it we're just going to destroy ourselves and it'll so 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 be it it'll be sort of okay that didn't work <laughs> but if we are able to let's try <laughs> let's see and i'm seeing so many young people that are so amazing and conscious and doing the work and like oh so beautiful to perceive Anyway, so I'm going to give you a tip on how to do it. It is through feeling your body. Okay, so we have different senses. Sight, to perceive things outside. We can hear. These are dimensions that we can perceive. We can perceive sight. We can perceive <clears throat> auditory information. We can perceive smell. We... <clears throat> We can perceive taste. We can perceive what things feel like, warm or cold, as an interpretation of an outside stimulus. Now, we can also feel inside the body. Now, when we go into the body, we feel into the body, then we are starting to access the inner body. Here, Eckhart Tolle speaks about you know, the, the inner body being this gateway to pure consciousness. And I'll do another video where I explain how we go into that clear line of the consciousness. But the inner body is this inner awareness. So it's to feel your body, but we're feeling your body is not associated with feeling and interpreting an outside stimulus, but really it's, it's feeling the presence of your own body, of your own vibration, of what, what, your, your your life inside yourself like your presence inside yourself and it takes a lot of practice to start feeling the inner body modalities like yoga qigong um, dancing yeah they are all very good to 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 bring us into that inner awareness you know when you feel a line running through your body you feel like a stream of energy whoo, helping you to balance helping you to feel that stretch that line through the body so these are all pointing towards feeling understanding the energy body the the the, the inner body the, the inner awareness now the way we shift into the new earth or the way i do it <laughs> is I close my eyes and I put my awareness into what my skin feels like. I start on the outside. This is a good way to start. Start on the outside. Feel the temperature of the, of, of the air, the sun, the wind, your clothes on your skin. That's the first awareness. Then go a little bit deeper and be aware that you are perceiving from the inside. There's a vibrancy inside oneself that is aware of the stimulus. Now pay attention to that inner vibration. You can even feel like there's an inner vibration inside your hands, like a buzz, 
like a buzz, a tingling. Yes. And you can up the volume by giving it more awareness. Really, the weird thing is you want to shift the world. <laughs> but the way we do it is by going through the body, like through the body. That's the portal. So trusting this process of turning up the volume of sensing the body. And with me, and I want to encourage you to sense the body so deep, with me it starts like, I can even start like shaking a little bit. I feel so much inside my body that I even start shaking a bit. Or I feel, oh, I feel a tingling up and down my spine. You can just, oh, this, it takes a bit of practice to, <clears throat> in, the beginning, in the beginning you'll say, am I feeling something? Am I not? Yes, you are. It's like, am I imagining that? Yes. If you're imagining it, give it your attention. Give it more volume. Give it more volume. This is, this is the secret, is to give that inner awareness more volume, more like Turn up the volume, feel, feel more, feel more, up that buzz, up that buzz, up that buzz. And you can open your eyes. And what's happening there is your whole awareness is like inside, 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 inside. Now you can open your eyes. But with this inner, 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 inner awareness, things outside will just go. Wah! pop suddenly pop into brilliance now the difficult thing is <clears throat> if one is doing it for wanting an outside result like you want to move the stuff outside want to shift the new earth but understand that the shift happens in you in your body. So in that moment, your senses are not interpreting outside information, but your senses are completely turned inwards into an inner awareness. Because your outside senses go goes it goes through your brain and it gets interpreted with all your trauma responses, attachments, interpretations, blah 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 as you look at things, as you perceive things. But whereas if you turn the inner body awareness buzz on, you are perceiving with your body. <laughs> and your body is not a thinking mind. It's a being space. It's, it's, a, it's a space of knowing. It's a space of existence. It's a, it's a space of surrender. It's, it's a space of um, like just, just being with, with, with life. And where for a moment, when you go into that inner buzz, you so, sort of surrender the mind's chatter and the mind's interpretations. And you simply surrender to open yourself to this universal vibration of life which is flowing through you, which carries an incredible in intelligence way beyond your brain. Heaven is like way beyond what we can understand. Do you understand me? <laughs> heaven is like way beyond that. But we all have the capacity to enter heaven <laughs> through our bodies, through our bodies, through our non-thinking mind, through our simply like being in our bodies. And by simply being in this vibration in your body, you actually open, open a, a sense of perception to receive new intelligence flowing through this universal life source which is in everything through everything connected to everything as the wisdom of everything is timeless spaceless is like exists in us through us so for a moment we are connecting to that non-thinking vibration of simple being this vibration connects us to all of light source and <laughs> aligns us to how things truly are 
Because usually when we look, we, we look at things and we interpret them. <laughs> but now we are in a tune, in a vibration, where we tune into pure being. And through this, we are becoming able to perceive things as they truly are. And even if we only do this in little pinpricks, it takes practice. Now, I want to give you this sort of thing to do. It's much easier to do this in nature because there's a lot of life source, life force, like everywhere. But you can do it anywhere. If you in any space, um, in your meditation, in nature, and even somewhere where you're waiting in a queue or sitting or something, just for a moment go inward and feel, just feel your body. Just feel your body without any expectation. Just feel your body. I do like bringing in, I, I feel that does help, bringing in pleasure. Now, pleasure is, a, pleasure is a difficult word, but I feel pleasure almost opens us up to, to experience even more of the body. We say pleasure. A lot of us have a lot of shame around pleasure. Oh, no, it's not, not allowed to feel nice. Not allowed to feel nice. The thing is, heaven feels fucking nice. Heaven is heavenly. Heaven is really cool. Heaven is really amazing. It feels good. Now, if we free, if we tuning into the vibration of heaven, of the new earth, feeling, feeling good in the body, tunes us into that vibration starting to feel good <laughs> so feel your inner body feel that inner buzz allow it to be blissful to be pleasurable you know often when people get all spiritual they 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 they, they, they they're trying to escape out this terrible body <laughs> And they're trying to like be all serious and like, oh no, and like all these bodily pleasures, like, oh no. <laughs> but the thing is, this is a wonderful tool that we have. And through the body, we, we open ourselves up into this new vibration. So I hope um, this helps you. Please tune in to your inner body, into your inner pleasure. Even make love with your entire body, with your entire body awareness. Let all the lights go on inside your body. Oh, that's another click, um, trick. Um, let all the lights go on in your body. That really helps as well. So you can feel the inner vibration in your hands, you know, up your arms. You can push it down into your feet. You can feel it up your spine. You can push it into your face. Like really allow your entire being to be saturated with this sensation, with this vibration of, of pleasure. And, and, and just like taste it a little bit. Just taste it in little increments. See if you can open the curtain in little bits and see little bits of heaven and start getting used to it and be one of the team. <laughs> one of the team who's bringing heaven to earth right now. I want to encourage you to keep doing it. I love you. Please ask questions. I would love to answer them. Thank you.